Assalamu alaikum Samir so good with you in a previous video I showed a project of uh, automating windows blind this is that for making this project I did lots of testing with 28 BYJ 48 repo mode talk this motor is unipolar so in a follow-up video I showed how to convert this motor into bipolar mode as this doubles the talk I'll link both these videos in the video description in this video we'll do actual talk testing and we'll see the various ways a talk can be increased we'll debunk some of the myths of the motor talk and uh, we'll see eventually whether we can lift 2 kg weight with this uh, motor so this is the setup i have made to test the talk it is uh, made using make block parts it is uh, connected to the desk using an articulating arm and a clamp which is used for my camera the motor is connected to the setup a shaft coupling is connected then to the motor the diameter of this uh, shaft coupling is uh, 2 cm there is a thread connected to the end of uh, this uh, shaft coupling and on the end of that is a hook uh, on which the weight will be connected torque is measured in uh, gram 4 cm and uh, whatever weight I hang on top of this setup uh, it will be equivalent to the torque as the radius of this uh, uh, shaft coupling is 1 cm I'll be using this water bottle for uh, acting as a weight these two uh, weighing scale will be used to measure the weight of the water bottle the circuit being used here is an ESP8266 and uh, the motor driver are uh, ULN 2003 in the case of unipolar mode and duet motor shield in case of uh, bipolar mode more than a month's testing has gone into this project and it is not possible to post all the footage or else the video will become hours long so i'll post only those footage which uh, has some inference to it and uh, which shows maximum torque for each uh, test we do the first way of increasing the torque is by varying the speed of the motor. We'll use delay in the code for each step of the stepper motor. I'll link all the code in the video description. So let's set the code with 2 millisecond step delay and see the torque. This setup is using a unipolar stepper motor driver ULN 2003 with a 5 volt motor. The weight of the bottle is 330 grams. The motor is having a bit of a hiccup as the bottle is swinging but normally it is well capable of lifting weights till 370 grams during my tests. So the motor torque now is 330 gram 4 centimeter. Now let's slow the code with a 15 millisecond step delay and see the torque. Few other things to note is that the motor does not work at 1 millisecond delay, so the maximum speed of the motor is at 2 millisecond delay. The setup is still using a unipolar driver with a 5 volt motor. The weight of the bottle is 910 grams. So now the maximum torque for the 5 volt motor in unipolar mode is 910 gram 4 cm but at a lower speed. The second way to increase the torque is by using the stepper motor in bipolar mode. This code is uh, for stepper in bipolar mode. We'll keep the delay same as before at 15 milliseconds because we know slowing the code increases the torque. So there is no point in testing at lower delays. We will use the Duet motor shield which has L293DIC which is a bipolar driver and we will use the same 5 volt motor. The voltage applied now is double at nearly 10 volts with the 8 1.2 volts batteries. The weight of the bottle is 1.7 kg. So now the torque has almost doubled at 1700 gram 4 cm as compared to the unipolar mode. The third way of increasing the torque is by using high voltage motor. The 28 BYJ48 stepper motor comes in two variants, 5 volts and 12 volts. 
there are many forum posts and videos on the internet claiming double torque with a 12 volt motor but if you see the data sheet for uh, the 12 volt motor uh, it has 350 gram force centimeter torque which is not much higher as compared to the 5 volt motor there is a variant of the motor which has lower resistance and higher torque but i couldn't find any manufacturer or vendor who is selling this we will be testing the torque with 12 volt motor having a coil resistance of 200 ohm per coil so let's set the code with 2 millisecond step delay and see the torque this is the same code which we used for 5 volt motor and this is the unipolar code This setup is using the same unipolar stepper driver with a 12 volt motor and a 12 volt DC power supply. The weight of the bottle is 650 grams. So now the torque is 650 gram for centimeter. Now let's set the code with 15 millisecond step delay and see the torque. Again the setup is the same unipolar stepper driver with a 12 volt motor and 12 volt DC power supply. The weight of the bottle is 1 kg. So now the torque is 1000 gram force centimeter. We can infer from this that the torque is doubling when the step delay is low but it is almost the same when the step delay is high. So you can't say with certainty that using 12 volt motor will double the torque. Now we will do the test with the 12 volt motor in bipolar mode. As I was expecting that uh, either the motor will burn or the driver will burn with uh, high temperature, high voltage, high load. I did all the testing on camera. We'll keep the delay same as before at 15 millisecond, but the code is for stepper in bipolar mode. We'll use the Droid motor shield. The voltage applied now is 21 volts with 14 1.5 volts batteries. I want to increase voltage and weight slowly as I don't want to burn anything. The weight of the bottle is 1 kg. The motor is able to lift it. The weight of the bottle is uh, now 1.5 kg. The motor is not able to lift that. The voltage is now 25.5 volts with 17 1.5 volts batteries. Actually I made a calculation mistake. Uh, I wanted 24 volts and not 25.5 volts as uh, 24 is uh, double 12 volts. The weight of the bottle is still 1.5 kg. It is able to lift that. The weight of the bottle now is 1.72 kg similar to the maximum weight lifted by 5 volt motor when it was used in bipolar mode at uh, 10 volts. It is not able to lift that till the top. Actually top does not depend upon time. Uh, I want to see that at least consistently the motor is working at a particular top. That's the reason why I want uh, to see that it uh, lifts the weight till the top. Now the weight of the bottle is uh, 1.65 kg. It is not able to lift that. The weight of the bottle is uh, now 1.6 kg. It is not able to lift that. The weight of the bottle is now 1.48 kg. It is not able to lift that which it was successfully able to lift when we began the test. This means that something is giving up over time. It could be either the motor driver is getting hot but I don't feel it. The motor is definitely getting hot to the touch. 
maybe the AA batteries are not able to hold the load so i'll have to get a 24 volt dc adapter and an alternate uh, motor driver to see if that helps off camera i had connected 24 volts to the shield using 16 1.5 volts batteries the weight of the bottle was 1.7 kg and it was able to lift till the top which means most likely it is heat issue because uh, yesterday the motor was hot due to continuous testing anyway uh, we'll test with the 24 volt dc adapter this is with a 24 volt dc adapter the weight of the bottle now is uh, 2 kg it is not able to lift till top since it fails after some time, most likely it is a heat issue with the motor driver or the motor as we have already isolated power issues. I got an A4988 uh, bipolar stepper motor driver as an alternate to the L293D. I have already tested uh, the torque with uh, 30ms, 15ms, 5ms. It is able to lift 2 kg weight but uh, it drops after some times and it is not able to sustain till the top. Let's try with uh, 2 millisecond delay. The weight of the bottle now is uh, 2.01 kg. Not only is it faster, but it is able to reach the top. This most likely means that due to high resistance of the 12 volt motor, it is generating too much heat which causes the motor to stop. Faster steps means it is able to reach top without the motor getting that hot. So the answer is yes, the 28BYJ48 can lift 2kg weight. Thanks for watching and do subscribe.